Welcome to the Hitchhiker's Guide to the Cosmos, the Beginner's Guide to Astronomy. In this edition, we're looking at meteors. Meteors, or as they're often known, shooting stars, have absolutely nothing at all to do with stars. They are, in fact, tiny grains of dust that are burning up as they enter the Earth's atmosphere. At any particular night of the year, you can go into your garden, and if it's nice and clear, you'll be lucky not to see at least a couple of these little brief streaks of light going across the sky. But at certain times of the year, we see lots and lots of meteors or shooting stars, and astronomers refer to them as meteor showers. Now, as a comet travels around the sun, remember, a comet's a dirty snowball, it leaves a trail of debris, a trail of dust behind it. And if the Earth happens to pass through that trail of dust, we see lots and lots of these shooting stars or meteors. And at certain times of the year, we see these meteor showers. The most spectacular in um, August and again in December. In August, we have the Perseids and in December, we have the Geminids. And the meteors all appear to come from one point in the sky. It's a bit like driving a car through a snowstorm. All of the flakes of snow appear to come from one particular um, point in the sky. And in space, in astronomy, there are constellations, there are star patterns, and wherever the meteors appear to come from, that's what we call the meteor shower. So the Perseids come from the constellation of Perseus, the Geminids come from the constellation of Gemini. Now, the meteors themselves, say you can see on a, on a shower, you might see 20, 40, 60, 80, may even be 100 meteors per hour coming through and burning up. If we have a meteor storm, you can see thousands of meteors per hour. They're pretty rare, but they do occasionally happen. And of course, if you do see a meteor in the sky or a shooting star, there's one thing you always must do. You must make a wish because you never know. Well, that's it for this edition of the Hitchhiker's Guide to the Cosmos, looking at meteors. If you have any questions, please use our comments box, and we'll see you next time. Goodbye.